Hello and welcome there to the, well this is the ninth drawing, uh, drawing special, you know, just, just teaching, teaching these children out here, just the, the standards of such a, such an important art to basically your, your everyday life, um, today your materials will need a sharpie, preferably with the, uh, the, uh, part of the text, uh, nibbled off there. If you, if you see the full text, you'll kind of get distracted and start reading it, and, I mean, the next thing you'll know, you could be in the bathroom eating corn or something. And, uh, hold on, let me actually, oh shit, I just got some marker on my desk, that's, that's gonna be there forever. Let me get some, uh, get some music for you here, uh, what should we go with? Uh, we can go a little, a little bizarre, for volume three. You know, I like to just have a have a friendly atmosphere, a peaceful atmosphere. And the uh, best way to do that is just through some some nice, some nice ambient tunes. Put that puppy in there, and uh, yeah, we can we can enjoy. I'm not sure what the volume situation is looking. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Wait. Shit, that's not my... That's not my bad company tape. Oh well. Oh well. I'll have to dig that up later. But anyway, let's get started here. Um, this is volume 9, so we're, we're actually going to get a little more advanced this time. Uh, for, you're going to want to get yourself some, some Silly Putty. This is Glow in the Dark, actually. Uh, found that out the hard way. And uh, you want to kind of mold yourself a shape here. Um, let's see, we'll go like that. Do a little of that. And then just like, you know, a few little bumpies right there. And that is, this, this is a crab right here. So now, I mean, you can draw, you just outline this thing. Don't, don't get any marker on the putty. Your, your, uh, your uncle will get a little mad. He'll probably get out the old belt on you, but... You just outline this thing, you basically got a real-to-life recreation of a, of a crab here. Or, or whatever whatever beast or element, uh, book, wall, you, you can craft your putty into whatever shape you please. And then just make these things come to life. And look at that. Just like that. Careful. You got yourself a, uh, look at that, it's freaking crap, I mean, add some eyes here. You know, they, they have, like, their eyes hanging out like that. Put some pupils in there, maybe a little, there you go. Look at that. It's like I'm freaking a red lobster right now, man, I don't even have to leave the house. But that, that was, uh, that was technique number one. That was the putty technique. Always, always store your putty, store your putty in a safe container like this, uh, I actually got some uh, some shampoo bottles as well, some empty shampoo bottles full of putty. Um, now, uh, the second technique we're going to be employing here today involves tape. Uh, this is a unlabeled, well, actually never mind, actually it says scotched right there. It's kind of see-through though, the, you know, the trick the common eye. You know, you could be using this on TV and I not even have to pay for the sponsorship. So you're going to want to, don't want to take yourself a little piece here. Do this one-handed. Oh, Jesus. There we go. And, uh, and fold, you're actually going to want to fold your paper from, from the corner, upper right corner preferably, and uh, just tape that puppy down. And now check this, check this. Gonna, you don't want you don't want to crease it like 100% crease, but get, get yourself a, you know, a decent half crease in there. Now we we can draw something here, and uh, this is just gonna be this is gonna be a very basic uh, a basic letagorical shape here, as you can probably already guess. And uh, this is kind of if it if it turns out right, which I mean I know it will. I've been doing this for 32 years now. Um, have these finishing touches and just like well, just like that. Believe it or not, when I un when I take this tape off and, and unbend this corner here, 
these shapes are actually gonna kind of come to life and form a happy little, a happy clown. Watch. You just take your tape off. Look at that. You got yourself a freaking clown. Now you just, uh, just add some eyes here. And uh, put some pupils in there. You got yourself a freaking clown, man. Freaking Bozo the Fourth. This is already labeled. I don't even have to label this. I don't even have to, you know, sign who these guys are. So that, that's your that's your standard tape technique. I call it the uh, uh, the standard tape technique. And now uh, this is our, this, this is only for the uh, for the pros out there. If you're uh, if you're watching this, um, we're gonna get yourself some some eyeglass cleaner. Uh, I mean, uh, contact cleaner works as well. Shake it up a little bit. Um, you know, unscrew the cap a few times to get them juices flowing. Now you actually, you actually want to spray it here. And, uh, you know, gently glide your finger in there. Gently. Oh, oh that's nice. That's, that's rather nice. You gotta be tender with this paper, man. And you, you'll start seeing some kind of... It's kind of black mold foam on it. That's actually the uh, the interior of the paper. What most people don't know is, um, see, on paper you got on the back side you got paper, and on the front side you got paper. But actually, in the middle between those um, is zinc, and uh, you kind of it actually kind of comes to surface with some water. And now we can just do some watercolors here. Just uh, what should we draw? How about how about a Gundam wing? Yeah, you get your little, got your little antennas. And you got like a little, always oh, got a crystal there. You can just draw a, oh look at this baby. Freaking Shars counterattacking, gonna have a chance now. And just draw your eyes. Put them pupils in, boom! Freaking Gundam V Waltz. Instant, instant. Now we're running out of room here, so we'll turn to the back where it's a uh, it's a clean slate, and uh, let me put that. In, never mind. And uh, let's put that cleaner up. We don't we don't need that cleaner more than once. You don't want to uh, you don't want to over clean. You don't want to over clean your papers. That's that just gets ugly. And now we're gonna uh, take a uh, this is a R two seven Y pipe, and uh, see a little plug in right there. Uh, normally, I charge I charge my pencils in that because you know my pencils run out of batteries a lot. But uh, this also serves an interesting purpose here. If you uh, put your put your hand in like a claw motion, you know the hook claw hammer. Hook one hook one of your fingers on the uh, the outer rim, the outer side, and then you can kind of got to kind of. Oh, there we go. There we go. Ooh. Now you got yourself a hole in the paper. This, this, this is this is key here. Let's readjust. This is key. Now watch this. Watch this. From this hole, we can actually we can actually look at that. Look at that. We just drew. We just drew some scribbles around that hole. I mean, if that hole wasn't there, we couldn't have drawn the scribbles around it. But thankfully, we have this pipe. We have this very. We have this pipe to do so. Uh, if you want to order one of these, just Amazon R7Y2, and uh, should be the, should be the first or maybe maybe the second result, depending on uh, if it's Black Friday or not yet. And now finally, let's end it with a uh, end it with a showstopper. And it, uh, you actually want to want to take your your World of Warcraft. Uh, key generator you, know, you press this key and you just download the game from pirate bay and there's your uh there's your, it's your key generator you know it's your crack basically and so you want to write this down so i got a zero. Oh, i ran out of time you gotta be quick you gotta be quick you gotta hope your camera's not turning pink because it's a piece of trash you just write that down zero four two six two one now i, I like to uh encase it in a little uh Little outline. Actually, I'm gonna do it twice because uh, well, <laughs> I don't gotta say why. Well, you guys know why. And uh, 
Now, if anybody asks what that number is, you can tell them. It's your Warcraft key generator number. You know, you can hang it up like a little... Look at that. It's like it's a... It's an ornament in your room just hanging there. Just hanging. Put like some, uh, some water dripping. Right, it doesn't even have to be water if you don't want to. You could say it's... You could say it's blood, you could say it's some, like, uh, the numbers have a runny nose. And sometimes for extra detail, you can make a drip coming from the drip. Look at that, double driplet. Drippy's two for it. But, uh, let's see, what do we got here? It's looking... Man, that is, that is a fine piece of work right there. You know, just hang that baby on your, uh on your living room or on your fridge or wherever you wherever you put your artwork. And I like to I like to end them all with my signature here. There we go. Oops. There we go. And uh, that'll do it for um, the official volume nine of uh, the drawing set. Uh, volume uh, 10 through 12 will appear every day for well, not every day. It'd be 10 through 12. So three days in a row, starting, uh, it's going to be August 14th of 2022. So uh, I hope I'll see you then. Um, until then, adios, boy.